all right I can disable the light if I don't need to use it hyperlink hyperlink give you ability to add the hyperlink or URL page to your button so if you're gonna click add link and type your website and then add link it, it will go to that website when you're gonna click on that button and it will print you the HTML code with uh, already code that will go to the website if you will embed that code like so and this is the website that's selling cool button designer and if you will buy from this website I guarantee you that your cool button designer will be 100% safe and clean and uh, right now it has the uh, holiday discount of $9.99 instead of $14.99 which is the best value uh, you can ever get and as you can see cool button designer has some international awards from all those websites and uh, if you will click on those websites you will go to those websites and you can see that they stated so it's not like somebody made that banner it's just on their page there is some examples you can play with but not limited to and as you can see it can work on Windows 7 uh, 32-bit 64-bit a home premium home basic professional and ultimate version it can work on Vista home premium home basic uh, professionals 32-bit and 64-bit also it can work on Windows uh, XP service pack 2 and higher um, on 32-bit and 64-bit unfortunately cool button designer doesn't support uh, Mac OS X yet so go ahead and get it it's $9.99 for a holiday discount and I believe this is unbeatable volume but you can also try uh, the cool button version for free by clicking over here all what it will do it will create the watermark on a button and after you're gonna buy a license it will remove that watermark alright let's get back to a cool button designer so we just learned how to add the hyperlink now we're gonna uh, tweak and add our text and I would like to uh, have search set and uh, I would like to make it bold and uh, make it larger like 12 and uh, I would like to move it like so and over here I'm going to put the image and also you can change the color if you want it let's say to gray if you want it or let's say I want to wait uh, and when you're gonna put your mouse over I would like to have it as a gray you're welcome to do so like so so it will give you a uh, look that you're putting your mouse over like better visual look you can make a shadow beveled uh, engrave glow glow bevel glow engraved and glow shadowed I'm just gonna keep it shadowed so it's gonna give me that more text 3d and uh, you can see you can uh, play with the position of the and some other f f uh, basics uh, colors of the shadow and stuff like this and also make the text transparency like by so you can see it's getting more transparent if you need to adjust so okay so um, the next is going to be add image and add image feature com comes with cool button de designer version 7.0 and uh, newer versions it doesn't come with the version 6.0 and version 5.5 5.0 so keep in mind version 7.0 will bring you a new feature at image and um, this feature will be available for free for all people who purchased the cool button designer earlier versions just please check your email uh, and you will receive um, the upgrade for free 
or you can contact us anytime at mrzmedia.com. Thank you so much. So I'm going to add image and I want to add image and uh, I want to go ahead and um, add I want to go ahead and I want to add um, search uh, this image right here as you can see this image right here has the blue background and it's in PNG format so um and it appears on the button with the blue background but let's say i don't want that blue background it just ruined my button so all what you gotta do you just gotta go and select the auto and the program will use its intelligence and will remove the background one color background from your button so Basically, what it will do, it will remove the first left top pixel uh, color from your button. So, whatever in that color, it will be removed. So, that's how automatic mode works. And there is, you can reset if you don't like it, the way it does. And you can set manually uh, what color you'd like to remove from your button. But you need to be very precise, otherwise it's not going to remove that color. So, uh, if you don't know the color, because you can set the values by going define customer colors right here you can set the red green and blue the way you want it RGB but if you don't know the colors uh, then what you need to do you need to click auto this is the best solution for you otherwise try to use some third-party applications to see what it what what the colors RGB values that you're looking to remove all right, then you can go to the position and click the position, whatever you need to uh, have your button, as you can, uh, the image on your button. As you can see, it has the three ways of the automatic positions. If you're not happy with those, you can also bring it to a manual. And uh, up and bottom. And you can also... Um, zoom out make it smaller if you need so and I'm going to zoom out uh, my icon and um, cool button designer version 7.0 give you uh, gives you this um, unique ability to zoom out your um, to resize your image on the fly without any third parties applications or programs which is nice so you don't have paintbrush or whatever to resize your image you just can use the cool button designer uh, pre build it option and why I'm trying to uh, resize it just because I'm, I'm going to have the reflection of this image for a better visual look let me show you in a second I'm just gonna move uh, Y a little bit higher and X like so and maybe make it bigger by alright so what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna uh, bring that reflection like I told you by clicking enable image reflection and uh, it's all, you can see it brought some reflection uh, to our button uh, image right here and you can control the transparency reflection the way it's transparent you can bring it more or less and uh, you can also control the reflection gradient level let's say I would like to have more than half of the button displayed and as you can see if I'm gonna adjust it it's gonna bring more like so you can also uh, play with image transparency the overall image transparency so by adjusting those values to 255 and make it a little bit more transparent like so if you need so all right also um, let's say um, if you did not select mouse over state and mouse pre st uh, press state images for those statements uh, cool button designer will make it automatically for each state for you but uh, if you will uh, go ahead and select individual images for those uh, it will uh, basically use 
every single image um, for every single state let me uh, show you what I'm, I just meant let let me go ahead and bring this one right here and um, right here you can see uh, mouse over state at the hundred percent and mouse normal state at the seventy around seventy percent which is this bring you brings you a nice animation like so and it's 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 nice good looking button as you can see so you can also like play with your imagination and brings uh, bringing a better looking button a visual to your button when people gonna press on your button or to put the mouse over you can make like that um, animation look like even if it's not based on the three PNG e graphics it still will look like animation alright so you got an idea and uh, same thing for mouse press state uh, you can uh, let me just go ahead and just put this one this guy right here just to demonstrate you and um, like that and press green alright this was just it was just for a demonstration purposes alright so you get an idea and this is the new feature for a cool button designer version 7.0 or newer versions thank you so much my name is Alexander Moroz and today you just watched a video tutorial about cool button designer version 7.0 which will work for any versions of cool button designer uh, starting after version 7.0 so it's going to be version 7.0 or newer versions and please go ahead and I encourage you to try it from www.mrz media website just search for it just google for cool button designer come to official website download the trial it's 100% clean like I said and I give you my world, uh, my my word. So and uh, clean, no spyware, Edwards, um, Edwards, whatever. It just pure clean software that will work on Windows XP, 32 bit, 64 bit, Windows Vista, 32 bit, 64 -bit Windows 7, 32 bit, 64 bit. Thank you so much. My name is Alexander Morose, and uh, have a nice day. Good luck with your cool buttons. Bye bye now.